I always had instinctively a feeling that the earlier you started reading to children, the better it was. I had a teaching background, but I didn't have an early childhood teaching background. It was something that I think I just, I just knew and felt instinctively. Um, but the more I have been involved in reading to children and going around to early childhood centres, watching children who have had books read to them at, at home and who haven't had books read to them at home, the difference is, is so alarming and, and where I see children who are just so comfortable with language and rhyme and rhythm and, and have concentration and attention span and just soak up stories and soak up their eyes almost glaze over whereas the other children I've, I've found when I was doing that particular project children were even unsure as to how to hold the book mm. and, and it was so distressing um, so I have a, a 14, 15 week old grandson who now knows, not because I'm doing it, but because he has this ability now of looking from left to right as I turn the page. Yeah. It just it just reinforces how important it is to, to get that love of language and visual awareness from a very, very early age. And I've seen people who We've got children who are readers and where does it all start from? You ask them, did someone read to you or did you have books written? Yes, they did. Yeah. Well, they just did. to know that there's an experience in a book. Every time you open it, there's yes. something inside. It's not just yes. a flat bit of cardboard. No, no. And kids are learning at such a rate and the younger mm. they are, the more they're taking on. Mm. So the left to right thing would just be immediately mm. instinctive once they've got the hang of it. Yeah, um, yeah. yeah. So yes, I'm I'm absolutely committed to you know sort of encouraging everyone to just read and as the young as possible.